students welcome all of you in this lecture on introduction to dye stuff industry so this is paper number 5 that is dyes which is a applied component today we are going to discuss natural dyes now the definition of natural dyes they are the dyes which are obtained or derived from the plants animals or minerals so these are the natural origins Now the first natural dye we are going to discuss today is a indigo dye. It is a very well known, very famous dye. The Hindi name for this is neel. Marathi name is neel, and the appearance of this dye is dark blue crystalline powder. Now we can see the structure. It is a highly symmetrical structure, and it is obtained from indigo fera tinctoria plant, and this plant is widely available in our country. now here we have shown one picture that is a fabric a jeans dyed with denim denim blue color so this is a major application of indigo dye in the field of textile industry now the second natural dye is tyrian purple this dye is obtained from a kind of shellfish you can see one picture is there it is a picture of a shellfish on my extreme left now from these shellfish we will get a very minute or small quantity of a dye that's why this dye is very costly and in the old days this dye was used only by royal family that is king family that's why the another dye another name for this dye is royal purple dye now we can see the structure of this dye the ipac name of this dye is 66 dash dye bromo indigo now we have shown the two pictures showing the fabric dyed with tyrian purple or royal purple the third natural dye is madder now the madder dye it is obtained from the roots of madder plant now the roots we can see the picture at the center these are the roots of madder plant and the picture of a plant is shown there which is having a green color now initially the roots will give us rubarethric acid it is a glycoside which is on hydrolysis will give you sugar and bases now in that bases the active component which is the actual component giving the color to this dye is alizarin we can see the structure of alizarin alizarin it is nothing but 1 to dihydroxy anthraquinone so it gives us a very bright red shade there is another name to this dye which is called as turkey red now the turkey red because it gives a bright red shade when dyed using turkey red oil so we can see one picture which is showing the fabric dyed with madder plant now the another dye is hina hina it is very well known very widely used and it is produced on very bulk or large quantity we can see in one picture the hina dye is shown which is, which is extracted from the hina plant now the chemical name of this dye is lawson we have shown the structure of lawson it is nothing but 2 hydroxy naphthaquinone now hina gives us a reddish brown shade now the use of hina it is there in uh, cosmetic purposes uh, our hair our skin can be dyed with hina now the next natural dye is turmeric turmeric it is the roots of turmeric which is giving a red uh, yellow color dye now the structure of turmeric it is shown it is also known as curcumin the structure shown is of curcumin which is actual coloring matter present in turmeric now the use of turmeric it is used in the food color so in the food we in our kitchen also we widely use turmeric in our foods so it is well known food dye as well as it has medicinal value or medicinal use so in pharmaceutical it is used as an antiseptic dye thank you for patiently listening thank you very much